Hey guys, Technomentary with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you guys how to customize your app icon on your iPhone 12, 12 Pro, or any of the newer iPhones that's running iOS 14 and above. So make sure that you are upgraded to the latest iOS above 14 or so because you'll need this special app called Shortcuts. But before we go ahead and get started, if you guys are new to the channel, we do a lot of tech news reviews and giveaways, so make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, as you can see in my hand is iPhone 12 Pro. If you guys are looking to buy a discounted iPhone, make sure you guys check out the link in the description section. So let's go ahead and get started with today's video. So to change the icon, you do have to run this sort of shortcut that's not quite uh, there yet, but it definitely gets around and allows you to really customize the app icon. So we simply open up shortcut it's a default app that comes on all iOS with the newer updates. Once you have done that, you want to click on that plus icon. And once you open up that plus icon, you want to add action. Click on add action. And the one thing you're going to search for is app open and search app open, something like that. So you're going to want to note is this open app so open app is the one that you want to choose so open app allows you to choose an app that you can create a shortcut for and once you have done that you're going to want to select what app you want to do it for let's say we wanted to create a custom for camera so we're going to select on camera and then you're going to click on these three dots up here and once you have done that let's say we wanted to name the icon if you wanted to you don't even have to put a name if you don't want to but we'll keep camera still as the letter and then we can select the icon that we wanted well let's click on this side over here and then we're going to look for a cool image for our camera here let's see if we can find something neat so we see that camera icon now we can change the color let's say we want a bluer color and we hit done and as you can see for now this is going to be the, our icon and then we're going to hit add to home and you can click on it again and you can either select that or you can actually go ahead and select a picture so if you have a picture that you want to download from the internet or in your photos make sure it's in your photos or you can take one you can simply choose from a file as well we're going to choose a photo let's say we want to choose this random photo we have you can also choose that hit that done button and as you can see, it's added to the home button and then we're going to hit done, click on done here. And this time around, as you can see, there's a new shortcut. It says new shortcut. And if we open that up, we get to our camera. The thing right now here, it says new shortcut because we didn't go ahead and change it. We can always come back here and take a look and do the same thing over. And of course, for this one, we can go ahead and edit again for this camera one. So we want to add to home button. And we can change that up to camera again, and that will allow us to do the same thing. Just keep on doing it for each application. If you want to do another one, you can keep on doing it. And you can really customize a lot of that. Unfortunately, the app icons doesn't bigger ones, widget aren't currently working, but this will allow you to really customize some of the cool ones out there as we've seen. Uh, that people have done it. So there's multiple ways to do that as well. So hopefully this video is helpful. If this video was helpful, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.